Hey guys, this tutorial is going to teach you how to do a live audio recording on Facebook, a live audio recording on Facebook. So if this is your first time joining me, I'm Jay Stone, AKA the brand mother. That's my picture right there. So let's get started. So if you open up your Facebook mobile app, this is what it looks like. Now I do want to make the disclaimer that I'm actually working on a Samsung Galaxy Note 9. And I've also verified that this feature does work on the Note 10. So Note 9 and higher, this works for you. Okay, I don't know about iPhone, don't use the iPhone, and I don't use other Android, so I can't answer those questions, unfortunately. However, they probably work really, really similar. So the first thing is when you open up your mobile Facebook app, you go right here when it says what's on your mind, to just like you would write a normal status, and then you will put your title and... After you type in your title, your title here, and then just below where it says add to your post, watch this. If you see the little bubble there, that's my mouse. So watch, I'm going to click in that section and then you get all of these options that you can do. Okay. So I'm going to click the option that says go live. Okay. So now, normally this is where you would hit down here, the start live, or you could choose some of these options. We don't want to do any of that. At the top right-hand corner, you'll see the three dots. Okay, the three dots. And when you see the three dots, something pops up down here at the bottom that says live audio. So let's do it again. Three dots and it says live audio. Okay, one more time. I click the three dots, pop up at the bottom, and I click live audio. And right away, you start seeing the audio wave so that you know that it's picking up your actual audio. So the next thing that you want to do is to click this plus button in the top left, okay? Because that allows you to select an image so that people are not just looking at your just looking at a blank audio or whatever, okay? So I just click that and if I hit edit, I can actually adjust this image here. Click save. And it's gonna resave the image and crop it so it moves it in a little place and it says drag to adjust so I can move it up, move it down. And then that moving it over happened when I did edit. And that's when I was able to move it over and then it moved it over. But that up and down, you can do it right here inside um, the app. And then once I'm done adjusting this image so that it looks like I want it to look, I click done. And then when I'm ready, I just actually hit start live audio. And then the audio actually goes live and you'll start being able to see people pop in and people look at the come uh, start to comment and things like that let me see if anybody's going to pop in so you can actually see that it really really works um so keep in mind that facebook live is a little bit delayed so people get the notifications and they start jumping in like much later um, so it probably, so keep talking for probably 30 seconds to 45 seconds before people start to jump in. Nonetheless, it's still there and it's still available. So when you're done, you actually click finish. Nobody came in. Oh, poo. And it says ending live audio. And then you would make this either public or for your friends only or whatever you want to make it for. And then you can delete it if you don't want it to keep going. Um, or you can hit share and that'll put it on your timeline. And then you'll get a notification when it's done. And I'm going over to my timeline now. So this was one that I did earlier today. And you see it actually says audio broadcast. Listen, I was about to write this long dissertation. So, and you can see it's just an audio with an image for people to look at. So it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. It works on your Facebook uh, personal profile and it also works inside Facebook groups. I think it's a pretty cool feature. So you should try it, especially if you're self-conscious about like what you look like right now. 
um, or you just decided you didn't want to put on makeup today, this is a good way to still create content. All right. Hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel and we'll catch you guys on the flip side.